The rats, why did he need them? Bloody rodents. Better to have stuffed them with a poison. Kira, what are you doing? Geralt. <laughs> you gave me quite a start. But nay, the mage says bring me rats and healthy ones. Not something the cat dragged in. This the lamp from the elf's hideout? And what's this about rats? Nothing important. I'll explain later. Now tell me, to what do I owe the pleasure? Mentioned you wanted something from me. I did, and still do. The cursed isle on Lake Windama, you've heard of it, I'm sure. The local peasants mumble incessantly about it, about the wraiths that haunt it. They claim none who go there return. How'd it come to be cursed? That's what I don't know. I must break this spell, yet I've been unable to identify its source. Gotta know something. Scraps. The curse is somehow linked to the tower where Serard, the lord of these lands, took refuge when Nilfgaard invaded. Claims in the village are that peasants, desperate of hunger, sailed to Fike Isle to beg for food. Met their end there. It was a massacre. So, will you please help me lift this curse? You're so good at these things. All right, I'll help. I knew you'd find it irresistible. Naturally, you'll need to sail to Fike Isle. Fine. What then? Well, the spirits who wander the Isle, you must establish a rapport with them. Don't know how. But they could point us in the direction of the curse's source. Think they'll be willing to chat? Of course. Provided you take my magic lamp with you. I shall let you keep it afterwards in appreciation. You'll find it quite useful, I'm sure. How's the lamp actually work? I mean, do I just rub it or do I have to do something, um, magical? <laughs> you needn't even rub. Just place it where you find bones and hear whispers. Um, I suppose I should warn you. It might not be the most pleasant experience. Figured as much. Tell you all about it later. Maybe skip the drastic bits. You'll need to do neither. I'll give you a Xenovox. It's a bauble that will let us speak over some distance. You will tell me what you see, and I shall tell you what to do and look for. I need to know anything else before I go? No, that is all. Oh, go already. I can't wait to see what you discover on Fai Kyle. Just be sure to come and see me afterwards. And... Geralt. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Heard of the fly head brigade? Thank you. 
here. Great, broke already. Sheesh, short lived this magic. What did you say? There's some interference. You must be very careful. Show me what you got. To us. They're not letting Graham in! Quiet, the fool. Babylon and the noble himself will hear you. Nah, he sat his arse on silk pillows, lightly begobbling meat. <laughs> 
With no notion we he's coming to tear him to shreds. Waste clear, lads. Adam! Not your lucky day. They left us! Look! All of them don't win! We've to swim! Come on! They left us! Look! All of them don't win! We've to swim! Come on! They left us! Look! All of them don't win! We Look, all of them don't win. We've to swim. Come on. What about all this? We can't leave it. You go. Find a boat and come back for me. If you make it across. <laughs> Why wouldn't I? Be back before you know it.
wonder what led them here. Hunger or greed. Where's that noble? Lying here, quiet as a mouse. Head split open like a rotted pumpkin. More like a peasant now. Sloshing around in his own blood and shite. Be nothing noble about him. Too quick a death they gave him. Should have been made to suffer. He's not the end of it. Sons can suffer for him. And the daughter. To the top! The place is full of rats, as many dead as alive. Think they're feeding on... Look, Geralt, stop. You needn't be so detailed. Rich folk. Doubt I'll ever understand them. Keeping rats in cages like rabbits. Let them out, maybe? Like to die of hunger if we leave them there. I'd sooner burn the vermin. Releasing them's not like to bring no good. Imagine the harm they'd do if they swam back to the village. Swam? Rats? How do you figure they'd do that? You needn't fret for them. Clever little bastards. Clever in you. Hmm. They seem sluggish to you. For the mange, maybe? Oh, and that stench! Nicely. Don't 
Don't start, Annabelle. Back to your craft. Always bending my ear about fool peasants. I'll not hear of them again. That simpleton turned your head. But one Graham hardly makes the rest courtly, one and all. My lord, peasants, they're through the door in the tower. now, will it? Stranger is still here. The noble died a time ago. Who's that? Show yourself. Anyone there? Who? Who are you? I'm at the top. Nothing here that looks like a laboratory. Mm -hmm. Someone dragged something across the floor. Or dragged it from one wall to the other, repeatedly.
Why did you leave? You claim to love me. I'm cold. Why has no one come for me? I cannot leave this place. I see no way out. Who are you? Do you seek to hurt me as well? I'm a witcher. I want to lift the curse that grips this island. Your turn to tell me who you are. The other ghosts, they couldn't see me. I'm special. Always was. The rare beauty. The Lord's daughter. These lands, as far as the eye can see, were ours. My family and I were hid in the Mage's Tower to await the rule's end, the end of hard times. It was not to be forever. Tell me what happened here. Peasants sailed to the island to ask for food. Is that true? No! They came to rob and kill! They thought us rich, believed we'd stowed ourselves away here to laugh at their misery. Yet we had little food as well. Too little to share with those who came. They slaughtered everyone. I heard my father cry out, but the mage told me not to reveal myself or let anyone in. He gave me a potion. If I was discovered, I was to drink it. He said everything would be all right. What kind of potion was it? Remember its smell? What it looked like? I remember only that I feared to drink it. Didn't trust the mage? In the village, they claimed he meddled in disease. Not curing it, but causing it. They said he lured rats into the tower, infected them with the Catriona. Only rumors, surely, but I was afraid. So horribly afraid. And then I heard him. My beloved Graham. He called to me. I opened the door for him, but others rushed in. They lunged at me and... and... Did they hurt you? They gripped my arms tore at my dress. I managed to free myself and drink the potion, and then... nothing. Poisoned? That how you died? No. For I later awoke. I was alone, it was dark. Only there were rats. Everywhere. Dozens. Hundreds. And I... couldn't move. Sleeping potion. Effects hadn't worn off yet. You were paralyzed. They were everywhere. All over me like insects. My face, my hands. I felt them rip open my skin, then crawl into my stomach. They tore me apart, and I could not even scream. Have I not suffered enough? Why can't I leave this place? How can I help you? A curse born of hatred binds me to this place. Only love's power can hope to lift it. But who could love a race? And your beloved, he dead too? Graham. No, he lives. I would know if he died. But he fled and abandoned me. Left me here all alone. Maybe you could strip the curse of its power by forgiving him. You might cleanse the isle. As I see it, you're the curse's focus. The other ghosts on the island, their auras aren't nearly as strong as yours. My medallion started pulsating as soon as we started talking. I don't know what you mean, but you do seem to know some things. You could be right. My fate is tied to the isle, I feel that. Perhaps because I am heiress of these lands. It could be your blood ties to the land, the base of the curse, that is. If so, forgiving Graham, laying your resentment to rest, should lift it. I... loved him. I'm prepared to forgive him. But I must know that he regrets what he did. Take my bones to him, he must bury them. This will be our farewell. 
Will you speak to him? Will you do this for me? Fine. I'll talk to Graham. Where will I find him? He lives in the village on the lake shore. Yet... What if he's forgotten me? If he loved you, he'll remember. And want to help. He said he would always love me. Go to him. Make haste, please. Experimenting on humans. Never would have gotten away with it if the Conclave were still in charge. in there until the end. What a shitty way to die.
you. I don't want to see no one. You got to. Just leave me be. And this be the Witchman. Why have you been following me? Just wondering what you want from him, from Graham. Me? Didn't want nothing. It's his mother be worried about him. Been locked in his hut since he came back from the aisle. Talks to no soul. Love's misery curdled his brains, I reckon. He won't be as cocky once the oh. man's man whip your arse. I want to talk. You deaf dammit, I told you. Who are you? I'm a witcher. What of it? Why should I care? I've been to the island. I know what happened there. What do you want of me? Want to talk to you about Annabelle. Annabelle? What can you know about her? I met her. Talked to her. Annabelle's dead. Drank poison. And I... I couldn't save her. Did you love her? I... Something mad. Loved her so deep I believed we'd come through, believed we'd be together. Of course, it was not to her father's liking. His daughter and a plain lout. What happened on Fike Isle? You gotta tell me. To her Millie, Finch and Faulkner, they rallied the men, all roughs, to go to the Isle, take back what was ours from the noble. They knew I was known at the tower, that the Lord's servants would open the gate for me seeing as I sold them fish. They forced you to go with them? No, I... I saw my chance in it. For Annabelle and me to flee. But... It all spun in a chaos. Our boys from the village, they started killing everyone. Annabelle, they wanted to rape! First, then she drank the poison. Mage must have gave her. I ran out of the tower, hollering that I wanted to die, cursing them all to hell. Don't force me to speak of it. No more, please. It wasn't poison. Annabelle drank a strong sleeping potion. Mage wanted to protect her, make it look like she was dead. Convinced everyone. But that means... Is she... You said you spoke to her. Spoke to her ghost. By the time she awoke, tower was full of cold corpses. And rats. She was warm meat. Rats ate her alive. She was alive the whole time. But... Can't be. She was cold all through like a corpse. We shook her, begged to open your eyes. I never thought... It's not your fault. No guilt in not knowing. And you couldn't know it wasn't poison she drank. Gods, what have I done? If I had stayed behind to bury her, I'd have noticed she was alive. It might have ended different, ended well. If you'd stayed on the island, I doubt you'd have survived. I'd take death over leaving her to the rats like that. <sighs> There's naught I can do about it now. Wrong on that count. Annabelle needs you. Her soul will only find peace if you help her. But... What can I do? It's too late. Bury her bones. Annabelle should be laid to rest by one who loved her. It's the only way to lift the curse that holds Fike Isle. Those are... Her bones? Yes. Give them here. And leave me be.
And now she's free. Hey there. Geralt, just when I was starting to miss you. Fike Isle's free of its curse. And you withheld this news until now? Why? I gave you a Xenovox. But the curse, what was its source? The dark spell clung to the spirit of Annabelle, the Lord's daughter. To free her and the Isle, Graham, her beloved, had to help me. So it ended well. Mm. I lifted the curse so the island's clear. Annabelle's soul is free. Thing is, turned out she's a pesta. Graham's dead. And you fail to notice. You're losing your touch. Be that as it may, Fike Isle is free of its curse. That's important. I'm almost inclined to say good work. <laughs> 